My name's Logan. My name is Devin. So our product is an application that will help teach people what they're meant to recycle, as well as techniques for recycling and where to recycle stuff that isn't commonly put in your recycling bin. So my product is the Energy Generating Stationary Bike. Me and my partner collaborated and we figured out what problems we were passionate about in the world and we narrowed it down to energy. We ran into the challenge of trying to put together a piece that was unique and efficient. I feel like with engineering products, it's really hard to figure out how these products will work in an everyday situation. So my product is Breathe Easy. It's basically a simple solution to the major issues of pollution. Since you can't get rid of pollution all at once, it's basically protecting the people's health and protecting a mask away from the pollution and kind of filtering out the air particles that we breathe in. The High School Utah Entrepreneur Challenge is meant to introduce high schoolers across Utah to innovation and entrepreneurship. The Lasonde Institute believes that the high schoolers absolutely have the ability to change the world. One place to start is through the High School Utah Entrepreneur Challenge, identifying problems and thinking of creative solutions. I chose to enter the competition just to like figure out exactly what I wanted to do. I knew about entrepreneurship, but I didn't know the process of it, and I really wanted to get familiar with that, as well as just learning how to work with someone else in a business. So the High School Utah Entrepreneur Challenge that I participated in was so much fun. It was like a lot less intimidating than I thought it would be. A very casual and fun feeling and also at the same time, it gave you like hints of what entrepreneurship and the competitive business life is like. My father um, is an entrepreneur and he started his own business. Um, and so I always thought it was kind of cool how he was able to, you know, build an idea from the ground up. Uh, we thought it would give others an opportunity to know that they can um, have their ideas become a real thing instead of just an idea. How I would help someone with their idea would definitely be to just think about the problems you see in everyday life. Think about things that you think, oh, if only this could be solved, how much easier life would be. And those little simple things is what really affects a lot of people. Really seek what you're passionate about. Be open-minded to every aspect of the world and narrow it down when you're ready. Don't just rush into it. We encourage you to start by identifying a problem, thinking of a creative solution, and using the tools and resources that we've provided to take action.